Hi and welcome back T again. So we created the second fire lighter with the Z4 and now we're going to create the last fire lighter which will don't have an ordinary shape. It's a very nice shape. I will explain why. So create a new layer. T select everything for sure. Call it missile uh, missile lighter. Why hide this? It's because it's looking like a missile. I have this fire lighter from Moscow, very nice city by the way. And for this I wanted first to use some references, but I didn't find any. Uh, I was not searching for long for any. So I'm going to use again my fire lighter in my hand and try to do it here. Okay, create a cylinder. Again, from a primitive shape, we will start like this, move this up, and press F4. Press M, material editor, track is here, okay. And convert it to poly. Okay, from this shape, we will start. And now let's define the shape. Okay, <coughs> move this a little bit up. Something like this, and scale it just a little. Now, for this, I will use bevel and move it up somewhere here, scale it, move it. Now a little bit inside, 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 and the last one like this. Mm, okay. Something like I have. Select these edges and connect. Now scale this a little bit to, to the shape. Now select this edge, this edge, loop it and scale also this. <coughs> okay. Mm. And select divert. Select these vertices and move them up a little bit. I want that it will be bigger. Mm -hmm. Yep, something like this. And I thinking to make it a little bit uh, fat. So top zoom, not this scale line, but this one. Perspective set. Yep, it's better. So some shape like this. Very <coughs> easy shape. And for this we will use again subdivision. So first select all the parts, let it top and collapse. Now move this a little bit up. Yeah, like this. Now, 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 I'm thinking to make this not so fat. So like this, this, and this, loop all. Okay, first select this, control by edge. And now again, this, this, and loop. And make it a little bit slimmer. Now, before was better. Okay, keep it like this. It's fine. Just maybe this poly at the top, I mean this edge is controlled by edge. Make a little bit bigger. Yeah, this is better. Okay. When we now use subdivision, like most of the time, let's go to, we have nearly a nice shape. 
everywhere. Maybe my free mega smart. I don't see everything. I think two will be enough. Yeah. We have a nice shape just here at the bottom of the town. We have a shape which I wanted. Cool. So, turn this off. Now let's go fix this top. Uh, select all edges and connect them at once. Okay. Now let's go here. Still thinking if I have the right shape. I hope yes. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, so if I edge this, should be not so wide. Select this all. Yeah, this is a lot better. Okay, so let's go to the top, the uh, bottom. Now here just a small, very small detail, very easy to do. Select this and inset it like this, and extrude it a little bit back. Now select. This and this, uh, this and this to loop them, chamfer, uh, chamfer, double. Let's do a double chamfer like this. Now select this, control by edge, and chamfer like this. Just subdivision here. Great. So we have a missile lighter, how I want to call it. Missile lighter. The first shape is done. So easy. Really, this file letter is looking great. Now, turn this off. Select by edge, select these edges, connect them. Uh, do I need to connect them? Mm, no. No, I will not connect them. No. I hope you first listen, uh, first watching, then do it. So you connect them and make it a little bit bigger. Like this. Just to define the shape. And this will be our shape here. I mean the cap. This will be going ah, this one. This will be putting out and inside and out inside. You will see what I mean, what I will do. Okay, select all this, <coughs> detach it, <coughs> detach it like missile cap. Now hide this. Go here, up, up, ups. Select by border, select the top border, cap the border. Okay? Now, now, here's a detail which we have to do. First of all, oh, right now, uh, I need to insert, the, insert this more times. First of all, uh, like this, apply, second time, somewhere like this. Now, select this and this. No, it's too much, so I need to cut here something, but I will connect. Like by edge, select these edges here and here, connect them once. Mm. Hm. Okay, 
also the same here connect okay now select this and extrude it down uh, like like this by minus three minus three now delete this and this not that and that my bad yeah this and this select this and flip yep just quick check okay this is right now select these edges connect move this here scale it in to match the shape yep like this now select my bird I hope I can weld now if not I have a problem well I can if I have it doesn't matter so weld it down okay and now select my poly create and first create this one now border select what was it working somewhere is not world vertex okay first let's create then we will look okay we create these polys ah <laughs> I don't need it. This thing. Uh, so like this. Okay. Let's check. Here's one. One. Here two. Weld. Okay. That's good. So create something like this. In this hole, we'll connect <coughs> the part from the up. Now. From here begins the part where, where the fire is burning, which is very, very simple. Too much simple, actually. I'm surprised. Uh, and it's like half and half. Cut and let's cut it like this. Okay, mm. now select some word and we are going to move them. Select these two, move, just make them a little bit straight. Select these. And also this yep something like this now do I want to insert yeah I will also insert it both of this and this by polygon by very very small amount oh. less I guess thinking before the chamfer. Okay, first chamfer, then this. Because we need to chamfer. We need to chamfer this top. Whoop. We, we need to chamfer this. And also this one. And also this inside. Okay, check the edges. But here will be not a big chamfer. Just a small one. Just remember, zero zero seven. Okay, it's like by the, by the zip. It's good. Mm. Okay, back first. We will cut. 
align from here to here now back to edge chamfer okay press okay and now move this vertex a little bit back it's a lot okay now we can try our subdivision view it's great Thinking also about the smaller chunk for now when I work on it. Now it's fine. Okay. Um, before we do anything else, I will fix something here I saw. Select this and set it. I. <laughs> like this. Just bring here more polys. We don't have. We don't have to cut anything. No, bad idea. Bad idea, dude. Bad. Why are you doing this? Okay. Maybe three. Ah, I see. I see. No, we don't have to use three. I just will pull, ah, select this police, slice plane. When I selected was the police and now the slice plane, it will slice only police which I selected. Slice it here, a little bit down here. Okay, this should be fixed. Ah, I wanted to do small chunk. Hmm. Okay, I think it's already late for no this this is fine I think okay back now it's too late okay forward ah it's f this will be enough why I don't have any chamfer here Files of these and fix this like here. Started weld, weld is here. Mm. This one here, okay. <coughs> okay, so do like this now. Let's go here. This I will straight to okay now and set the group by zero zero six apply okay and the same let's do here now select this middle edge a loop it Loop it. Hmm. Loop it, but before a cut, quick cut here and here. Yep, no, back. I didn't cut it to the right. So here and here. Now edges again. This one, I can put it in the ground or how I want. No, it's not. A loop. Select these two. The same here. I want to create a gap. Something similar like on the zipper. Okay, extrude. Haha, <laughs> too much. Less. Base, less. this like this so we have selected still selected the bottom edge 
now select these and this group. I'm selecting it here and chunk to all by the smallest amount which we can. Okay, now let's use the subdivision. Great! It's working nicely with a nice shape here. It's fine, it's good, I like it. Okay, four. Now, my poly. Uh, select also these. First, no, first this one, it's more easy. Select also these and just extrude. Extrude it somewhere. Oh, it's also. I'll just move it now like this. Now select edges, select these, 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 these first. Chunk them just a little bit like this. Now select this and loop. And let's try this and loop. It's not working. Okay, select all around now it should work now it's not working and this time yeah chunk for this with a bigger chunk like this okay now we can try subdivision if everything is fine yep it is it's great I like with something which I have in my hands it's going to be here in max. It's nice feeling. Okay, turn this up. Now select these police. Also this one here. I want to keep a cap here. I think this is too big cap, so select also this and this. Now extrude it somewhere here first. Now how to do this best will be to use bevel. I think okay let's try bevel inside ah ah Okay, extrude and we'll do the shape. Uh, extrude it by zero. Four. Ply, 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 ply. Uh uh, too much police. Zero five will be better. <coughs> zero five. Zero six, maybe. Uh, maybe zero eight. Ply, ply, ply. Okay. Now select by vert top ones. I will try scale it like this. Oh no, move them back. Yeah, scale them more. <coughs> be like this. Yeah, in this shape we want to go. So, select now this line and scale it. It was too much, I think. So we will go back. Yep. 
here. <clears throat> now, select these. Just check if we selected first all and second the right ones. Okay, scale this. Hopla. No, it's fine. It was fine when I did this. I think it was too much. This would be enough. No, it's not okay. I'm selecting some birds which I don't want. Be careful. More careful than me. I'm sure you are careful enough. Just me. Just me. Now the last one. Select. Okay, remove. Scale it. Okay, then just a little bit. Maybe like this. Yep, like this. <coughs> Sorry. Now, here. Select these and these and scale them a little bit. Just. Also this, I'm going to try to create a shape here, which I wanted, and I'm sure you do. Stop choking. Yeah, something like this. Maybe also this and so make a little bit more. This. Okay, now select. By poly and no before patch joint link select patch select this one loop this one loop and also this one loop jump fun too much and I wanted to say not too much like this. Oh, select this. Select this one and loop. Select this manually. A loop. Chamfa. Let's check this shape here. Yeah, great. I like it. I like it a lot. It's, it looks very nice. Oh, I'm proud of myself. Yeah, I am. <laughs> okay. Ah, I'm crying from happiness, by the way. Not kidding. Okay, select this and set them uh, like this. Select also this one and set them not so much, less like this. Okay, <coughs> this is done, this is done, and this is done. It was, and how you see, it was very easy. It didn't take as much time. Now I want to create another gap. Select this and loop all around. No, jump up. Jump up, actually. Maybe a little bit more here. Select these two again. Not that one. I just deselected. A free, just to check. Yep. Jump up too much. Just a little bit like this. Uh, check. Yeah, great. Great, great, great. Now, 
what else will you have to do with the hole here? The making holes in my access. Hmm. Not that fun. For this we can actually use more techniques. Uh, but this I think I will do just later. First I want to do here this. At the bottom and the rest I will do in the next one. Just not to have it too much at once. Okay, select this poly and exactly the opposite one. It should be one of these. Hmm. Free. And now select these two. So I select just one. Free. Top. Uh, I want to see if they are in scale. Uh, no, they are not. I mean, not in scale, but in the right positions. Okay, <coughs> let's look. Okay, here would be one. Ah, oh, perspective, by the way. Here would be the second one. No, he will be here. Yeah. Somewhere here will be the next one. Here the next one. You probably know already what I want to do is missile wings. Or how to call it. Okay. Nice to us. Or maybe not. Anyway, I can anytime change this, but I will go to five. Here, yeah. Now, track them down. Ah, it is too much. Is it too much? I think no, 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 no. Don't say this. It's enough. Yeah, really, it's enough. <coughs> okay. Now, select this edge. Loop it. Why? No, I don't. Anyway, loop them with help. Select these four edges. Ah, before I forgot. Back, back. No, poly. Select this one first. Scale it a little bit. The same here. Here. And here. Plural. Now select the edge, select these, these, and these, track them. Chamfer like this. And before I do anything else, I want to see how it's now everything is done. Yeah, I think I will not jump for actually this. It's doing a nice shape here. Hmm. Like this, what I did, it looked on the file lighter. But like this, I don't like it. I like it more actually. Ah, this is a new now. I like this more. Hmm. Four. Back without. Frank, okay, <coughs> okay, <coughs> but uh, some other chances I have for sure. This is round, round, and the edge. So this edge chamfer. Same here, here and here, so jump for all. Now, um, I want to see how it's looking and what I have to jump for. Okay, this is the date, date, so I want to jump for D. 
these ones. And after it's done, you the edge of the edges. Probably not this. Select, select these, these. Did not select it. Select this back, and again, first I will temper one. I will look if it's okay. Uh, and after, I will do the rest less like this. <coughs> okay, quick fix. Here and here. And now, okay, let's let's look. Yep. Great, great, great. I like it. I like this a lot. <coughs> it's okay, it's better than my <laughs> strange. Okay, turn this off. Edge. Let's do the same here. <coughs> Sorry. Select these. Ah, uh, these select first. Select these, these, and these, and also this one. Now, the same here. These two. <coughs> these, these, and these. Okay, again these. These, these, check, 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 and these. <coughs> you can anytime. <coughs> Sorry, you can anytime fix anything on um, these models. Not so complicated so far, and pretty. It's very easy to fix on this model, not on every. You know, I'm thinking like, I guess this file writer will take us will not so much time, but it's not the most best thing. So I'm proud of myself, really beyond proud. Okay, well, these strange things. Sometimes I don't, I'm not telling what I'm doing because I don't feel that it's necessary for you. To say like okay, left click, select this. Great, it's great. Be proud. Our rocket is going to be cool. Okay. Turn this up. Press F4, and I will see you in the next time. Next part. I mean, because I want to do a little pause. Okay. So see you in the next part. Bye bye.